farmers around the world are well accustomed to braving the elements. But for Israeli agrarians along the Gaza border, the elements have nothing to do with the weather. They're man-made and they affect farmers on an everyday basis in the form of Gaza rockets. The seasonal need for plowing, sowing and harvesting provides enough incentive for farmers to defy military orders not to venture out into their fields. Here in Gistel uh, we have uh, about 200 workers that are coming uh, every day to work. In spite of the very difficult situation of the bombing from uh, south from the Gaza Strip, the workers are committed and are coming every day to work and committed to work and committed to the growers to grow all the plants accordingly to our uh, protocol. The sound of tractors at work is regularly interrupted by the wail of air raid sirens. Work comes to a halt as people run for the nearest shelter and hope that the Iron Dome will be successful in intercepting the incoming Gaza rockets. Companies in Israel must take precautions, such as constructing protection areas for workers in case of rocket attacks. In spite of the situation, we are on the site prepared uh, a few before. All the protection area, special cubics, they invested a lot of money to protect all the workers so they can have a safe place to run to while the sirens are going on. Nearly 1,000 rockets have slammed into Israel in the past week. And while the Iron Dome is proving a remarkably successful system to shoot down incoming missiles, the fact remains that normal life in southern Israel remains almost impossible until the threat of Hamas rocket attacks is eliminated.